So here's how the record returns product on QuickBooks Online. First of all, open up your browser and search for QuickBooks. After that, click on the first link to QuickBooks.com. Then you need to log in to your account or purchase a subscription. And once you log in, this is the dashboard that you will see. Now from the dashboard, you need to click on New on the left panel. So after clicking on New, you will get to see all of these options. Now click on Refund Receipt. So once you're here, click on the Customer section. Then click on Add New. Now you need to put in all the details about your customer. Make sure to go through and fill up all of these informations correctly. So once you're done setting it up, click on Save. After that, just go through all the other sections and fill them up, like your customer's email, billing address, refund receipt date, tags, and then click Payment Method. From here, make sure to select the correct payment method. Then, you need to select Refund From. Here, you need to choose the applicable option. So after you're done choosing, you need to scroll through and make sure all other information is correct. So after making sure all the information is correct, you're good to go. That is how the record returns product on QuickBooks Online.